If you want to check out a really nice private Discord server, link below in the description. Click on it. It's free until September 1st. I know it says you got to pay money, but it won't charge until September 1st. So it's pretty good. Spots are limited. A lot of really amazing trades here. So don't miss out. Now let's get back to AMC. We're seeing a bunch of major exchanges and also major institutions out there buying into AMC. And can I blame them? No. AMC is by far one of the hottest stocks out there. Not every single hedge fund, not every single trader out there likes AMC, all right? But they don't like AMC, but they still buy AMC. And I say it before, and I'll say it again. It's a really good hedge, actually. If you know a trader or a pretty wealthy investor that have like a bunch of money in the index funds and a bunch of money in very safe stocks, just tell them AMC is actually a pretty good hedge. Because what if there is a massive short squeeze of AMC? The market's gonna go crazy because a lot of the biggest hedge funds in the world have huge short positions on AMC. For example, Citadel, okay? Billions of dollars. We're talking about naked shorts. If AMC searches all the way up, no one wants another Archego situation. Archego, same exact thing. Over leveraging on a few stocks, and when those stocks went the wrong direction, the whole entire fund imploded and caused a lot of banks to lose billions of dollars. Goldman Sachs that day lost two to three percent. We also saw a few banks losing seven to ten percent. No one wants another situation like this. So it's actually a pretty decent hedge. And because of this, we're seeing a lot of ETFs and also a lot of big institutions buying into AMC. And not only is AMC just a good hedge, but AMC, after dropping down to $28 to $29, it rebounded really hard, all up to $31, $30. The reason why it did this is because everyone knows that AMC's floor value is roughly $33. So anytime when AMC is below $33, it's massively cheap. AMC has tested this floor value three times already. And every single time it goes down below 30, it bounces right back up to 32 and $33. It's a really, really strong stock. And because of this, we're seeing big institutional investors go into AMC. For example, MSCI, okay? They are showing off some of the big index reviews. If you check this out, it's pretty interesting. So 20 securities will be added to and seven securities will now be deleted from their indexes, okay? The three largest additions to the MSCI World Index is gonna be DoorDash, okay? AMC and also SITC International Holdings. This is really big because we're talking about AMC here getting added in. And because they're not talking about AMCs in these stocks being like a side stock. We're talking about these being the main stocks. Okay, we're talking about three largest additions, not three normal additions, largest additions. That shows you a lot of the shares actually have to buy, be bought. Right now, they need to acquire roughly 5% of the free floats, which is roughly 25 million shares. That's what everyone's talking about. 25 million shares, 5% of the free float. Remember AMC that went up like seven to eight percent a single day from just a mere purchase of like a few hundred thousand shares. I also remember this one time where AMC they purchased roughly two to three million shares and the stock went up roughly twenty eight percent a single day. So if you purchase twenty five million shares all at once or in a span of just like maybe a short period of like a couple weeks, the stock will be going up. So for all of you guys who are paper handing your way through AMC or all of you guys who are very scared of AMC, remember this. When you have an index fund as big as MSCI and they're loading the boat this much AMC, chances are the stock is gonna go absolutely nuts in the next few days. Once retail traders and other big institutions get a whiff of this, everyone is gonna be going into AMC very hard because this is probably one of the most popular index fund companies out there they're gonna be buying a decent chunk of AMC. And I think a lot of major indexes and also ETFs are loading the boat, increasing their share count of AMC in the past few months. And it's not just ETFs and index funds. We're talking about hedge funds also going in, all right? Retail traders are also buying more AMC than ever before. Look at all of the thousands and thousands of AMC shares being purchased in the past quarter. A lot of people enjoy the stock. A lot of people like the stock. They feel like it's a good company. And can I blame them? No. AMC is a very, very good stock because of good fundamentals. If you also check out some new pieces that just came out, AMC reaches a deal with Warner Bros. Four to five days. So when Warner Bros. comes out with any movies, it has to be in AMC movie theaters. Only AMC movie theaters. For 45 days, before going to other places like other movie theaters or streaming, HBO Max, etc. We also have AMC accepting Bitcoin by the year's end for movie tickets. And the earnings surprised everyone especially Wall Street. 
All right, reported 444 million versus 382 million expected. 16 surprise and also 25% you know, beat. That's great. $2 billion of liquidity, actually more than $2 billion of liquidity, which includes cash in a bank or undrawn revolving credit lines. It's big and no wonder a bunch of indexes right now and a bunch of major institutions want to get a chunk of AMC. And by the way, even some of the biggest exchanges in the world who don't even like AMC, they still buy AMC. These big institutions still purchase AMC stock. I remember a really funny article about like a fund manager. He didn't even like AMC, but they still purchased like a million dollars worth of AMC simply because it's actually a pretty good hedge. And there's good reason why. There's actually a lot of concern about maybe a major fire sale because of over leveraging. Because we've seen several major big funds and institutions out there that have been over leveraging themselves and shorting AMC. And given the fact that retail traders are not backing down and the popularity of AMC is still going up and everyone is still thinking about the Archego situation, nobody wants another Archego situation, okay? No one wants another major fund to implode and affects the whole entire stock market. It took a lot of effort, a lot of time to bring the market all the way up like this. And just to have it go all the way down because of some meme stock is crazy. And thus, we do have a lot of involvement from the government, meaning that if you're a hedge fund that you're about to implode from like a massive position, instead of selling your shares, you could just give your shares to SFT. They'll hold your long shares and in exchange, they'll give you a loan. You pay off that debt. You get your long shares back and things go back to normal. But of course, you gotta pay that money back. And another thing is, if you are really having to sell shares, they'll do a controlled fire sale. Meaning that if there is a massive sell-off, they will control that and prevent you from selling off too much. They'll sell off slowly instead of all at once like in those movies. So that's what's going on. And this is why a lot of funds right now are loading the boats, buying more AMC. They're a little bit afraid, they're a little bit scared about what's going on, and they feel that AMC might actually cause some sort of a really, really big change up in the market. So these funds, they're really smart. They're managed by really intelligent people. And when these guys are buying more AMC stock, something definitely isn't right. Also, the options are also going pretty crazy. We're seeing a lot of calls and a lot of puts being opened up for next week. Something very fishy is happening to the overall stock market, especially AMC. Let's see where it's headed to, because with this many options being opened up, we should be expecting some sort of a very high volatility for AMC. That's about it, guys. Thanks for watching. Comment below. Definitely check out Moomoo. Link below in the description. Click on it. Make a Moomoo brochure account using the link, deposit $100, and get two free stocks. It's pretty nice. 5K more, get two more free stocks. It's a pretty amazing brokerage, especially if you think about training. And yeah, some of these shares are pretty nice. And if you think about just changing some brokerages, then Moomoo is a really good one. Thanks for watching, guys, and see you guys later.